How's it going everybody? NBG here and we are going to start a let's play of Nehrim at Fate's Edge. This is a complete Oblivion overhaul. The uh, creator to this mod, creators I should say, it's actually a team from Germany uh, who basically took the engine of the game and just made their own game. This has nothing to do with Tamriel or the Elder Scrolls universe whatsoever. It's its own thing, alright? So forget everything you know about the Elder Scrolls. This is just running the same engine. So, hope you guys enjoy the series. And, uh, yeah, let's start it off. I honestly don't know what to expect. It's gonna be fun. <clears throat> that is an awesome loading screen. I have that actually. I used to have that as my uh, wallpaper. One of my computers, I'm sure. Oh, yeah, this mod is in, uh, German. It shall never drag me down, Ludwig von Beethoven. This mod is in German. Obviously with English subtitles. If you do something unpredictable, something never done before, against all human belief of provision. If you leave the path of your destiny in order to escape from it, and if you defy all threats lurking at fate's edge, then it certainly will not prevail. In most cases, the only trigger needed is an... Damn it. You guys can read. Okay, this game looks fucking sick. Set off. All right, so that um, I received this strange letter and foolishly accepted the invitation. I left the security of the Abbey. Uh, I guess the Abbey would be a city, maybe, in which I lived and worked. Ah, okay, for some paltry reason. Now look at the mess I'm in. I hardly entered this mine. I was clobbered from behind. Only the devil knows by whom. And now I wake up. Here. In almost total darkness. What the hell's going on? Oh, this game. Listen to that soundtrack. Awesome. Alright, well. Uh, yeah. Let's just check um, all gameplay options. Difficult to 25 for now. Uh, video, let's see, everything's jacked up. Um, yeah, there's really, the brightness in this game is kind of, uh, realistic, I guess. Let's see, so the races, we have the Elaman. The Elamani are the largest tribe in Nehrim, and were once the first settlers on the continent. From them arose the old Nordic kings who ruled over Nehrim. Akan's age before they had to yield to the gods. However, after the violent death of the god Erodin 1,000 years ago, this folk managed to flourish once again. Many Alami, Alamani <laughs> are educated, skillful craftsmen, and ar architects. Okay, so that's the Alamani. What else you got? You got the Hafaturna. Their superior skills and magic allow them to leave their home and populate Vin. Whatever that means. World of Nairim. Although they are outlawed in the world of Vin. Wow. An entire race is outlawed. That's pretty crazy. Uh, yeah. Half turn to emerge from... Blah, blah, blah. Their skills and magic aren't as strong, but these crossbreeds... Oh, okay. This is a crossbreed, I guess. 
Normani. The Normanis, or the Normans. I'm going to call this guy the Norman. <laughs> he looks like a Norman. The Normans are known to be harsh in Taciturn tribe. Blah, blah, blah. Necessary, however, since there are many of them. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So these are like the Imperials. These are like the Elves. And these are like the Nords. Alright. I'll pick the Imperial. Uh, face, I don't really care about. I'm going to go with stock. It's going to be 25 for whatever reason. Hey, I'm going to name him Nick. Nah. Mr. NBG. Now, how about hair? Because you look like a, a guy from the ages of the middle age. Middle e medieval. There it is. Sure. Oh, look at the lighting. It's like real light. Oh my! Oh, it's fucking dark. Damn, what have I gotten myself into? The boards broke right under my feet. Now I've lost my torch. Damn it, luckily I packed another. But who knows how long I'll be down here. Hope it doesn't burn out. Anyway, first I have to light it before I make any move. Okay. Oh, and by the way, just so in case you guys play, this is very, very objective oriented. It said I have to light it before I can move. Well, I'm see, I'm trying to move. It, I can't move. So when I light the torch, I'm actually gonna do that. I can move now. Na, warte, du Beast. Und wie hat dir das gefallen, hä? That guy spoke German. Danke für das Licht. Das hat ihn geblendet. Thanks for the light. Diese Mistviecher It's haben was gegen Fackeln. Blah, 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 Vielleicht haben together, wir so blah, blah. eine Möglichkeit, aus dieser Hölle wieder herauszukommen. Okay. Oh, ach ja. Ich bin zu uh, yeah, Okay, that's your name. Ihr habt da auch eine hübsche Beule am Kopf, wie ich sehe. Schöne Schweinerei. Irgendjemand hat uns niedergeknüppelt. Huh. Oder besser gesagt, irgendetwas. Okay. Und wie es aussieht, haben It wir jetzt like ein Problem. Problem. Those beasts here seem to look at us as food, which certainly seems to explain the dead laying around here below. Ain't that the truth? We need to get out of here quickly before more of these monsters show up. Thank the gods we have a torch. We'll be able to find our way out. Since the trolls have brought us here, it means there is also an exit somewhere. If I ever find out who's responsible for this letter, I tell you. Dot dot dot. Okay, did you get a letter too? Yeah, have I. Yes, he got the letter. It said it was to go to the mine, which is where we are. When I entered the abandoned tunnel, I was attacked from behind. Then you came crashing through the roof, just as though... Or just as though, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Diese Situation geht mir gehörig gegen den Strich. Und ihr seid auch wegen dieses Brief. Mir scheint. Why would you freaking follow the letter then? Like everyone was sent a letter that had no recipient and told you to go to some random ass mine. Also, ihr first things first, vorgehen. you must get right, get out of here, right? It, Dort liegt ein it's weird, auf like, uh, den I don't know if this is a direct Ahnung, translation or in diesem I have no idea how deep inside the tunnels we are. Und oh, somit okay. reden wir nicht so viel. Let's ich not talk so much. Hin? Yeah, I agree. Let's go. One thing I like about this mod already is that it uses real lights, which means that <clears throat> in Oblivion, a cave had a magical glow to it where there were no light sources and uh, yet you could see. Which is pretty fake. Um, where this, however, there are some things like magical mushrooms, for instance, which actually give off light and light their little area. But it doesn't light everything, you know what I mean? I like that. Whether it's realistic or not, who cares? It makes sense, though. Like, if you were to put a flashlight down, it would only light so much. Why did I drink that fucking potion? <laughs> Alright. Let's go up here. That's quite a drop. Alright. Oh, you're following me. Oh, cool. I'm gonna name you Celebro. It's a weird name. Maybe it's German. Okay. Not really sure where we're going, Celebro. Not really sure where we're going, but I'm gonna go, uh... Duh. Not that way. Let's go this way. Which leads here. 
Okay, left final. Oh my god, it's fucking. Oh, it scared me. Help me. Slow bro. You have a sword? Punch, 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 punch. Yeah! You have received some experience points by killing these trolls. As soon as you have collected enough points, you will level up. Awesome. Awesome. Can I loot these guys? 